Hello, guys. In this lesson, we're going to talk about using the shop builder. Let's get started. Facebook shops are best viewed using the Facebook mobile app. When your business has a Facebook shop enabled, it helps potential customers to explore the products on your Facebook and Instagram accounts as well. To access the shop builder, go to the commerce menu on your business suite. You can see that you can view and edit your shop here. Now click the button Edit Shop. The Shop Builder can help your Facebook shop look good as customers browse your shop using their mobile app. Under Layout, you can view a drop-down menu that shows the homepage of your Facebook shop and the name of the collection that you have created. This is how your visitors will see your Facebook shop's homepage and your collection. If you enable this feature, Optimize Layout, the layout of your Facebook shop will depend on customer information such as their shopping activities or interests. This feature will show a different layout for every customer who will check out your Facebook shop. Under Featured, you can view dynamic products and the collections that you have created. Select Dynamic and you can view the options to manually select a product which allows you to choose a specific product from your catalog or dynamically select a product that shows a product tailored to each customer. In this section, you can view the icon showing the products are dynamically selected. If you manually select a product, you can see a pop-up window to select products in your inventory. You may also add a new product here. Just click on the Add New Product button to manually add new products to your catalog. You can also use the Shop Builder to edit existing collections. If you edit your collections, you can add a title, the description, and upload an image for the collection header. Under Products, you can add or remove existing items in your inventory that you can add to your collection. Under Collection Settings, you can choose to feature your collection on your homepage. You can also choose to hide it from your shop or remove it from your Facebook shop. You can view your shop's inventory under the option More from the Shop section. If you have uploaded multiple products in your catalog, you can view them all here. The Preview section will show you how your customers will view your Facebook shop. The three lines will show the shop's menu. Your customers can shop all products, view the collections created, send a message, or use the Payments and Order section. Under Settings, you can manage your shop's visibility and inventory. By default, it will be visible, but if you need to do some editing for your shop before allowing it to go live, you can disable it first, then enable it later so that your shop can go live and be seen by your potential customers. Under Inventory, you can choose which products that you have added will appear in your Facebook shop. By default, all products will show in your shop unless you want to hide them. Click Advanced to show only products that are included in your collections. When you enable the advanced feature, the products that don't belong to any of your collections will now be shown here. If you want to bring in fresh and responsive leads to your autoresponder lists, we have a marketing app that can help you build your list and grow your business. You can get signups from Facebook ads as easy as a click of a button. Nobody has to fill out forms. You can connect with any Facebook page run Facebook lead gen ads, and send leads directly to your autoresponder. You will receive 100% accurate email addresses as these are the Facebook user's main account. Leads to List is a two-step forget system to grow your list forever. Just create Facebook lead gen ads, then connect Leads to List to your ad. That's it. Go to GetLeadsToList.in now and enjoy the benefits of bringing in fresh leads to your autoresponder. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. I hope you find this video helpful. Thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next video.